And now I'd like to turn the podium over to former Utica College women's lacrosse student athlete, Amber Buckley, who will help to present our first inductee. Good evening. I'm sorry I couldn't be with you all tonight to congratulate this year's inductees and celebrate Utica's senior student athletes. I have oh, no doubt that your room is both filled with athletic talent and a strong sense of pioneer pride. I'm honored to help induct Christy Patchett, now Christy Patchett Fishman, into the Utica College Pioneer Hall of Fame. I coached Christy in 2001 and 2002, when Utica Lacrosse was in its infancy. We were optimistic, eager, and rough. Christy was a lacrosse pearl and a scoring weapon. We relied heavily on her. The trouble was other teams knew this as well. We weren't deep in talent back then. We had the best student athletes, the best growth and development of any team in the Empire Eight those two years. But we weren't naturally talented or talent deep. Christy was our core and somehow Christy always managed to make it happen for us. When others may have predicted Utica didn't stand a chance, Christy put us on her back and made us compete and win games that we otherwise wouldn't have had a chance to win. I've never met anyone who had the grit, determination, and sheer competitive mindset that Christy has. Because she was our leading scorer and single greatest threat, she was always marked out. Everywhere she turned, she was marked, many times double teamed. Other teams knew if they took Christy out of the game, Utica didn't have much of a chance. That was a decent strategy at the time, and one that we all recognized, including Christy. However, Christy shined when we had our back against the wall. She could have two people on her and still manage to find the back of the net. It seemed the more tall the task, the better and more she'd ratchet up her desire to score and then do just that. She's a fierce competitor, and today I truly wonder what the lawyers on the other side think when she comes to do business. Christy sits before you as second on Utica's all-time scoring list. She leads all UC women's lacrosse athletes in goals per game. And she finished third in the Empire Eight, a conference that has a lot of national lacrosse respect in goals per game her senior year. Those accolades are impressive. Impressive enough to get you into your college hall of fame. But they're even more impressive than they sound in Christy's case. Christy was a true attacker not really meant to be running in the midfield or even all the way back to the far restraining line. In an ideal world, Christy would have just been in the attacking end, circling, waiting for her teammates to feed her. That said, Christy didn't have a choice when we were building our team. She was often in the middle of the field, forced to represent us on the defense and then figure out a way to get back up the field and score. And she did, and she did it double teamed and she still maintains those records long after Utica has built its program. Her ability to serve her team in this dual capacity while still putting up a record number of points is no small feat. It's a feat that very few behind her will be asked to attempt, and even fewer, if any, will ever accomplish. I know Christy as a leader and someone that was always willing to rise to the occasion. She was a good teammate, a coachable athlete, and the fiercest competitor. But all that said, the best part about Christy is that her success didn't end on the lacrosse field. She was successful in all facets of life, and she continues to be. Her dogged approach and inability to settle for anything less than the best left her earning Utica College Dean's List honors each of her undergraduate years, just three since she earned her degree in an expedited fashion. And later, she earned her art law degree. She represents the best of Utica College and the best of lacrosse. 
to the Hall of Fame Selection Committee, you've chosen a good one, an ambassador that will forever be the bar for future women's lacrosse inductees, as well as all other UC sports. I'm so honored to have coached Christy and now to honor her as a pioneer Hall of Fame inductee. Congratulations, Christy, and thank you.
congratulations to you all, and I wish you all the best of luck. Thank you.